what is up everybody vital syntax here and I got a custom creative class video from black ops showing off all my custom classes and the first one is my famas which is uh, the silenced ghost ninja class for super stealth measures um, it's got sleight of hand this is basically my try hard class if we're ever you know down by a bunch of kills or something usually it's best for like team deathmatch or something and I got the strella on to uh, help shoot down like air support just in case my teammates are getting pounded and they don't uh, have time to shoot them down so yeah, this is my try-hard class for uh, Team Deathmatch. Next class is the AUG class. Uh, I use this in Team Deathmatch as well. It's got dual mags um, because uh, it allows for me to spawn with more ammo without having to have Scavenger on. And uh, instead of Scavenger, I've got Hardline, and that'll obviously help me get kill streaks faster. So that's great for um, uh, Team Deathmatch. Uh, Hacker Pro is another great one for Team Deathmatch because you don't really need Marathon. Uh, to get you know get places faster so hacker pro helps me avoid the claymores and whatnot AK-47 class is basically my tank class it's got uh, the extended mags and scavenger on so I can basically just spray down hallways or just uh, I use this more of like a light machine gun class to uh, you know give a covering fire or something like that and since I'm always just holding down the trigger um, because I have basically have unlimited ammo and a huge magazine and sleight of hand um, I put Tactical Mask Pro on because a lot of people are going to know where I am, so they're going to be throwing stun grenades and whatnot at me, trying to uh, get an advantage that way. Next class is the Galil class. This is primarily used in Demolition or Domination. Uh, this is basically any anything that's a, a, a you know objective-based gameplay. Um, I've got Flak Jacket on so I can avoid the uh, deaths from explosives. I've got the Frag Grenade for a longer throw distance. Willy Pete's really useful for capturing flags in domination or planting bombs in demolition uh... marathon's also great for that and tactical insertion helps you know control your spawn point next class is the commando another great class for um, team deathmatch but i put marathon on so i can use it in something other than team deathmatch so if i need a ghost class that that's uh... not gonna be used in team deathmatch it's uh... great for that and uh... for some reason i think i'm not alone in this but the commando feels like it's a lot easier to use with the suppressor on it so uh, I put Warlord on so I can have the uh, dual mags so I have more ammo and I also put the suppressor on so I can use it more uh, the way I like to use it. Um, I've got the Strella on as well so just help my teammates out. Uh, next class is the FAL class. Uh, this and my M16 class are basically identical. Um, you can see I got Flak Jacket on because a lot of people that can't reach you with their submachine guns or you know FAMAS or whatever because you have a longer range weapon will try and you know throw grenades at you so Flak Jacket helps out with that. Harden Pro is really useful for um, you know making sure your bullets hit the enemy uh, because the, there's less flinch with the Pro version, and with something like the FAL or the M16, it's essential that you hit all your bullets because it's uh, you know really low fire rate. Uh, second Chance is really helpful if you're hide, hiding behind cover or uh, usually if you're using like an M16 or FAL, you're you're back with with your teammates. You're not running around solo um, in the front of the line, so uh, there's usually a teammate that can help you um, revive you or whatnot. Um, Got the motion sensor on, uh, and the frag grenade for you know longer distance uh, equipment usage, and the motion sensor helps you know covering your flank or whatnot, um, and you can use it more than once, unlike a claymore where once it goes off it's done. Uh, this is my Russian class. Got lightweight, steady aim, pro, and marathon pro. Uh, put extended mags on because I don't have sleight of hand, so I don't have to reload quite as often. Uh, got the tactical insertion. This is my favorite class for capture the flag, and it's really useful because you can you know control where you spawn. You can put it by their flag. And once you have a hold of the flag, you can basically run back to your base in a matter of seconds. So it's really useful. And then the last class is the sniper kit. Um, using the PSG-1 with extended mags. Uh, this is my probably my favorite sniper. Uh, Ghost Pro, not necessarily essential, but it's, it helps out quite a bit. Um, so you can move different positions and they won't always know where you are. Scout Pro, I think, is probably the best uh, sniping um, secondary, uh, second perk. Um, Season 75, Extended Mag is probably the best prime or secondary. And just like the FAL and M16, Second Chance Pro helps out a lot. And since I can't see my radar, you know, motion sensor doesn't help too much, so Claymore is better. Alright, so thanks for watching the video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.